you. Tonight, it's looking like the state Republican Party may not certify Dothan businessman Jeff Coleman as a congressional candidate for the second district. WDHN's Alex Valdez explains. This all stems from a court ruling that Alabama's congressional districts were unfair to racial minorities. That ruling extended the qualifying deadline for candidates. Coleman met that extended deadline but didn't meet the original one. And three days before he filed, the Supreme Court ruled it was too late to redraw boundaries. Now, a GOP source tells WDHN that state Republican officials are reluctant to certify Coleman because they feel like honoring the extended deadline would be like admitting the lawsuit against the congressional boundaries had merit, and they interpret the Supreme Court stay as also putting a stay on the extended deadline, which would mean that Coleman did not qualify in time. A source says those state GOP officials would rather the courts be the ones to order him on the ballot, and it could wind up in court. Coleman's representatives have been meeting with state GOP officials, and Republicans expect he will sue if the state GOP keeps him off the ballot. At least one GOP official tells us he thinks Coleman would have a pretty good case if he did sue. Time is ticking for Coleman to qualify. The deadline for candidates to be certified and sent to the Secretary of State is three weeks from today, March 1st. Of course, you could trust WDHN to keep you updated with any new developments in the coming days.